Ladies and gentlemen, we are entering my second hour of Tormented Soul. So far, I've only saved once, and I really don't know where I'm going or what I'm doing. I have been able to power, which is good, but I don't know where to go. And there's another floor here. What is this room? Locked from the other side. We're not doing that. Judith Beheading Holofernes, painted by Caravaggio in 1602. It depicts Judith beheading the Syrian general Holofernes in his tent after charming him. The reaction of Caravaggio's work is just outstanding. It almost looks like the original. Later on, they're gonna they're gonna say these are the originals. Watch that they bought them all or stole them all or some shit. Excuse me. Well, I have no idea how to open this. We're gonna backtrack to, obviously to the doors that were powered by electricity and see if we can get into those doors now. Here's one of them. The maternity ward. A photo of a nurse standing next to a patient. The maintenance crew logbook has a big spurting of blood on it. Evening shift, electrical maintenance, 1445. The nurses told me the lamp was malfunctioning in the maternity ward. When I turned on the lights, I could see that one of the bulbs in the wall was indeed flickering. As I was getting ready to change it, a man came out of nowhere and grabbed me by the shoulders, pushing me back with strength unimaginable for someone of his age. He told me not to touch it. I, sim I didn't want to argue with it, so I left... I can't stop thinking about it. Why did the old man prevent me from touching it? I should check it out. Okay. Well. Perhaps there's something to it, right? Perhaps messing with the bowl will, uh... Will do something for us. There's more ammo right here. So much like classic survival horror, I'm not gonna fight anything unless I'm forced to. I don't want to waste ammo, and it very well may be that you just can't kill the enemies anyway. In some of the classic survival horror games, some enemies take so much ammo, it's not even worth shooting them. So, I'm not going to fight unless I'm, I'm, I absolutely am in a situation where I have to. These are all full of various medicines. Look at this. What the fuck? Well, that's what I need. Her fist is tightly clenched from rigor mortis. Oh, really? chest was left open in the middle of a procedure. The heart is missing. It doesn't fit. <laughs> Darn! Well, I'm not going to fuck with that yet. What else is in this room? The water is switched off. There's the light bulb, right? <clears throat> down there. Do I want to know? Do I want to fuck with this? Because it seems like you have to put something in the chest first to get it to work. Yeah, you need to put something in there. <laughs> okay, then. Ah, the stupid camera angle rotated. There we go. I could regret this. Oh no, I don't know if I like this. Oh, okay, we have a new tape to save, that's good. I'm gonna be very careful here. Oh fuck. What is that? Oh, this totally isn't creepy or anything. Various mannequins are kept under the sheets. You think they're mannequins? You hope they're mannequins. Why is the music building? No, why is the music building? I don't like this. Stop this. Lower the music right now. I demand the music be lowered. Oh, I don't know. What do I use on this mirror? I have no idea. What? It doesn't fit? What? It wants me to interact with the candles? Maybe I can light the candles? Oh!
The fuck was that? What the fuck? Oh, uh, what? What the fuck is this? Now this is Silent Hill. This is 100% Silent Hill. We altered another dimension. We altered, we entered another dimension. I don't like this. No. This shit is Silent Fucking Hill. Ugh. Another thing of morphine. What's that noise? Oh, no, you don't. No, no, no. No, no, no. There's nothing there. There was nothing in that room. Just a nice vial of morphine. There was nothing else in there. Yeah, that was fine. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I seems like I have to get past that guy, but I don't know about uh, this guy. Uh, I don't like this. Is he gone? Oh no, he's not. I didn't take any damage, thankfully, even though he hit me twice, but that guy is a nice ass. Look at that blue girl's shiny butt cheeks. <laughs> Shiny butt cheeks. All right. Well, now we're talking. He had no legs, though. More nails. Okay. The auto aim is decent in this game. Chef Venus says try shooting off screen before they attack. You'll usually hit them. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Well, obviously we need to put... I think what it is is the, the dimensions will be connected like Silent Hill. So if we find the other half of this plastic heart and we put it inside the plastic baby, then when we go to the real world, we, the heart will be inside the body and we'll be able to, t to shock it and then get the, get, the, uh, get the piece we need, right? I think so. What is that? The water is switched off. The water is switched off. Well, that's good. So sadly, I don't think we can do this yet until we find the other half of the fake heart. I think once we find the other half of the fake heart... Oh, I can't see anything. I think once we find the other half of the fake heart, then we can come back here and do this puzzle. Why... Whoa. Why are the... The, the rooms are like portholes. Like you're in a fucking submarine or some shit. Oh, I can't... What do I do to this? I don't know. I don't think I have anything that'll open that, right? I can't open it. So, yeah, I'm not... I can't do this yet. I must have to go back to the real world, find the other half of the fake heart, and then... Oh, I just unplugged my headphones, didn't I? Yeah, it's loose. What the fuck? Why are my head... My headphones are being stupid. What the fuck? Hold on. There we go. Okay. My ones are a little loose. Alright, so I think what I need to do is go back to the real world, find the other half of the fake heart, and then come back here to do the puzzle. 
But I have my first taste of combat, right? And luckily I didn't take any damage, so that's good. Okay. OG Carl, I hate that that flooding happened in New York and everywhere else on the East Coast. It's terrible. What exactly would you like me to say about it? So Setsuki Warriors says, check the photo. Maybe there's a clue. What photo? What are you talking about? There's no photo. This is just the, the twins. I don't have any other photo. I don't know what you mean. I think we have to go back and continue investigating here first. So there is a door that was blocked. See that? In the real world, the door is blocked. All right. Well, let's go back. There's another door that opens with the power. I know that. Wait, what? I did take damage? Oh, it says caution instead of fine, so I did take some damage. Oh. That's weird that the heart looks the same, though. What's that noise? I've been in there before, right? Yeah, that's the door that opened. Oh, I don't like that noise. Oh! There's a lot of them in here. Eight shots to kill one. Eight shots. Okay. <laughs> that sucked. I wasted two shots. What do I think of the environment's so good so far? If you reload without the menu, it's the O button? Oh, okay. He didn't explain that. So here's a new door I could not open before, and now I can open it. Maybe the other piece of the heart will be in there. I can go back and save if I want. Oh, yo, 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 I could go back and save if I want. I have another tape. I have to remember where the fuck the save room is, though, because I don't remember. Down gives me the creeps. Meh. There's another one? Why are there so many enemies? Come on! Where's the save room? Where the fuck is the save room? This is the save room. Alright, I want to save. There's no heart in that mannequin, huh? No. not plug it plug it in why would you not plug it in well I want to save my game okay save the goddamn game so if I die I'm all right she didn't say anything huh Nothing else in here. 
I guess we're gonna go to the room that previously I could not open. Let's see what's in it. Right here. All right, guys, get ready. Get ready. Oh! <laughs> I distracted it with my tongue. And he's like, oh, oh, and he didn't attack me. Okay, that worked. Let's try that again. Shots does it, but now I'm almost out of ammo. I only have enough to kill two more. Surgical tools, they don't appear to be in good condition. X-ray images. More nails, that's good. Medical books, nothing useful. Oh, there's a pile of human organs on the floor. That's a oh, oh, listen to that. Oh man, that's nasty. William Wildberger's diary. 17th of September, 1941. As I crept quietly behind my father, the clock struck 1:30 a.m. I saw him enter the mausoleum after placing three elements of some kind on board, or on some kind of board. We went through quietly. I followed him at a distance. Trying not to make a sound, for I did not want to be caught. Okay. At Mother's tomb, my father sank to his knees and rested his hands on the cold, sculpted marble figure of his wife, and he began praying. I felt guilty following him. Seeing the cold and calculating man this way moved me. I was about to leave when father stood up and approached the angel statue. Mother's marble tomb moved slowly to the side and exposed a narrow staircase leading into the darkness. He climbed down the stairs. I hesitated for a moment. My legs not wanting to make another step, but I was able to stand and follow him down. Once inside, I heard metallic sounds and the echo of running water. A few moments later, I bumped into a ladder. I climbed down and found myself in a long stone tunnel covered in pipes and sewage. I saw a father silhouette turning a corner and hurriedly followed. Before me appeared a huge metallic door and a group of men wearing strange suits like those worn to protect from radioactivity. Each carried a giant hammer. My father joined the group and they re received him by hitting their hammers together. What is this? A hospital bed on each side of the group carried what appeared to be bodies covered in sheets. My father put on one of those disturbing suits. In my frightened stupor, I loosened a brick from the wall. It smashed against the floor with the sound of a thousand buildings crashing down. I could feel their eyes turn to me as I fled back the way I had come, their guttural voices screaming to catch me while they hit their hammers on the ground. What? Sure. More morphine. The drugs in the cabinet are neatly arranged, and look what I just found. Yep. And now I have a fake plastic heart, and I can go to the other world, put this in the baby, and solve that puzzle. Also, there's a nice hand dryer right there. Water is switched off. All right, I guess we're out of here, right? So now we got to go back, which was where? This way? I can't remember now. Fuck. Now it's from this way. Yes. Yes. Flatlined. You've been flatlined. Sorry. Okay. Oh, man. What do you guys think? You guys liking this game? I like it. It definitely feels like old school Resident Evil, but there's going to be a ton of backtracking in this game. I can already tell.
There you go. He seemed almost alive for a moment. Totally not creepy. All right. Good, the Black Sword is so far so good. Enjoying it. A guy whose name, there's no way I could possibly pronounce it. He's enjoying it. Ghost of Hyrule likes it a lot. Chef Bina says he likes it. I'm, I'm glad you guys are liking it. It's interesting, for sure. It's rare that you get to play a game that's retro, but it's new. You know what I'm saying? Like, pretty nice. So look. Yup. Now the heart's in there. Got it. Yep, and now we can activate the elevator, which is where we need to go next. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> Chef Venus says, The Resident Evil 2 Remake is my favorite playthrough of yours, and this is great for me. Awesome. So Sentikin Warrior says, I like the atmosphere and the lingering suspense. Swagging says the game does have a lot of backtracking. You'll find an item you can't use for an hour and you'll forget where to use it. Great. Oh no. Oh, oh no, 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 no. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. We're going to the elevator. Fuck that. Okay, I have no clue what's through here. Prepare your bots. It's the main hall of the mansion. Just like the Spencer mansion. La 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 la. La 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 la. Is it a safe room is the question. Nice music. La la la, there's a staircase down. La la la. Don't go there yet. No, no. What about these doors? Don't check them yet. You gotta look around. You gotta look for clues and items. What's behind the desk? You'll never know because there's no way to go there. Except there's a door there, so maybe you can from the other side. And what's this here? Nothing, nothing. You can't interact with it. Oh, look, a piano, Moonlight Sonata. An old piano sound that I don't know how to play? Well, fuck you learn. Do you, can you play this harp at least? Do something. What's in the fire hose container? Nothing. What the heck is over here? In this corner. What's in the corner? I just found more nails. Yes. And the nails. Make a phone call. All oh, the payphones are out of service. Son of a bitch. Well, this is actually very true. Anywhere you find payphones these days, they just don't work anymore. They're all disconnected. You know, at one point, payphones were insanely prevalent everywhere. What do we have here? There's a crest. I don't have a crest. So fuck you. I'll have to come back in three hours. When I have a crest, what's that creaking sound? Someone get some oil and fix the hinge. I don't like it. No, sir. Not one bit. Let's see what's upstairs. Oh, look, a creepy, creepy statue that says I need something. I don't have anything. So fuck you. <laughs> fuck your statue, motherfucker. We go upstairs. Oh, look, a door. There's totally nothing wrong with that door. What's this here? A sculpture of an angel confirming her greeting sister. Comfort the greeting sister, Krista. Oh, yeah. What's over here? I don't know. What's over here? I don't know. There's doors everywhere. What's here? Absolutely nothing. And now there's a bunch of bars. I can't go through there. There's a door here. Can I go to the other side? Let's see. No. Yes. Yes, you can. No, you can't. No, you can't. It's a dead end. What's here? You go through a door, this is probably a bad move. A waiting room. Waiting room. Uh, 
waiting room. What are they waiting for? Oh. It's locked from the other side. Okay. What you waiting, what you waiting, what you waiting for? Calendar 1994. A calendar. So every day was checked off until December 15th. They ended it December 16th for some reason. I wonder why. 1216. Could that have a significance? Could it be an important note, an important date for a clue for a puzzle? In 1994, what's the significance of that? Oh, it's dark over here. Oh, fuck me. Why is it so dark over there? There's a door? Is that a door? It is. Oh, shit. I didn't know that. I wasn't ready. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, fuck. Oh, I don't like that. That's creepy as fuck. There's breathing. There's bad noises. I'm staying away. Anything over here? What's this? Projection screen. A bunch of purses. What the hell? What's this? A tape player? But I don't have a tape. It's empty. If I found a tape, I can play a tape here. Also, there's a stogie right there if I want to smoke. Or is that a bowl? Someone's been hitting up some meth or something right there. <laughs> What's going on? Okay. Why doesn't YouTube like events like September and stuff? Because YouTube doesn't do anything like that. Maybe one day they will. It would be nice if they actually did. But right now, they don't do anything like that, right? Um... All right. Ladies and gentlemen, thanks so far. You've been a great audience. Quick intermission here. Thank you to Chef Venus for the latest Super Chat. Thank you to the people who became a member. We're now at the highest number of members ever at 251. Nine more and we hit the membership goal to do a Halloween marathon, which would be awesome. Thank you to uh, Trill One, who did monstrous amounts of tips earlier and got us to the hat goal, which is why I'm wearing the ridiculously silly hat for this playthrough, okay? We're at $113 at the $150 tips goal. If we hit $150, it's vest time, and all your favorite vests are eligible today, including the red, the platinum, the gold, and the denim. So I hope you'll consider contributing if you're enjoying this stream. It's something very different and fun, very old school throwback. And I'm liking it. I got more morphine, by the way. I'm definitely liking it. So I hope you guys will consider contributing if you're having a good time. I would love to hit the tips goal today. So I guess we should remember December 15 or 16, 1994. All right? I don't know what the significance will be, but you'll think it might have significance. Okay? Now, we have a corridor over here with obviously a monster in it because it made noise. I'm nervous about this. It's been a while since we saved. A new map. So we were just in the meeting room and we walked out to this hallway. Here we have a sewing room, an office, a bedroom, and a library. He had mentioned going to the library. Oh, did you see that? What the fuck was that? Can't open it. I'm gonna squirt in my pants. What was that thing on the wall, man? Oh, you need a floppy disk to get into a door? What? You need a floppy disk to get into a door. Have you ever seen that before? I haven't. Oh no, look! Yo, those swords are gonna come down and kill your ass. Oh, what is this? I don't like this at all. Yeah, squirt in my pants, Hershey squirts. Squirt liquid shit into my pants, because I'm scared. That's correct. What the fuck? Oh, that was a bad choice. You think there's a way to get by this guy without getting hit? Uh, I don't think so. Whoa! I don't think there's a way to get by him right now. Maybe later on there's something that you can see and attack at the same time. But I can't see and attack at the same time, so I can't get by that guy. 
Oh, man. Well, that's a no for me. I can't do it right now. I don't want to walk by, dude. This is like, this is going to be instant death. Those swords are going to come down and chop my body into pieces. And I don't have a save. I, my save is so far away. I don't want to fucking redo stuff. So I'm going to say for now, that's a no. I'll come back later. But I don't think that's the way to go. I think that's a very bad choice. Okay, I do. I feel that's not, not what I'm supposed to do here. Crowbar? I can't use crowbar because there's no light. If there were light, if I could have light... Hold on. See? You can either do the crowbar or the light. I can't have both. So I can't leave the light and hit that guy. I can't see. I'll die. Yeah. So let's go back and see what else we got. Because there's plenty of other ways to go. What about what's across over here? Locked from the other side. So that's a no. This, it looks like I'll need a way to open it from the other side again. It looks like there's a lock that only opens from one direction. All right, let's go downstairs. Let's see what's down here. There's a lot of stuff to do. So I could go... Oh, I just noticed this. More nails. What's well, all the way down? We haven't actually been to the bottom floor yet, right? Oh, this is a long staircase. Oh, I don't, oh, I don't like this either. What's this? fuck is this now oh my god dude seriously there's a million items you need <laughs> i don't know what this is there's like a hundred items look something can be placed here something can be placed here and something can be placed here well good for you what the fuck there's a hundred doors down here all right this is a dead end i see gasoline does this just go up to the other side let's find out Yes, but it's blocked. See that? Huh. Okay. La la la. The music is good. I like the music a lot. Um, so... Let's check some of these doors. Shut tight. All these doors are locked. Fuck. Oh, excuse me. So that's no. Alright, what about this? Alright, this opens. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh! Nope, let me get my gun out. Oh, no! This is bullshit. How am I supposed to get past this guy? He won't move. What a fucking asshole. And this is a dead end. I need something. Yeah, I need something to open this. Fuck. So the only thing I can do is get hit. Seriously. The only thing I can do is take a hit. This sucks. She won't target him. Come on. He's right in front of me. She won't target him. What are you doing? Why are you stupid? Don't examine. She's not targeting him. I hear him. Oh, 
Okay. Oh, another map. Where am I now? Oh, uh, fuck. Where am I? I guess we're in the archives? Yeah, this is the archives. From here we can go into the chapel and all these other rooms. Ugh. What? Why the fuck is there a Tetris diagram on this door? What the fuck is this? <laughs> Tetris! Okay. Oh, if only I had a coin, I could get a soda. Oh, I need to find a coin. I want some soda, man. I'm thirsty. Killing these enemies, you know. What is this thing? Is it dead? Oh, it's a statue broken apart. A smashed statue of Jesus? It looks like it fell off the cross. Damn! It's fucked up. If Jesus wasn't fucked up enough, then they threw him off the cross. here. I don't know I can see. Oy. Okay. Now, anything else? It's the map I just picked up the paper map of. In the bag. And this is the weird lock, the Tetris lock. Okay. Yes. Okay, let's see what's in here. Get ready. We're in the kitchen. I'm hungry, too. Ooh, what's in the fridge? Let's find out. There's nothing in the fridge. It's empty. It looks like you could put something in there if you want. Right? But there's nothing to actually take out. So if we need to make something cold, we come back here, I guess. Okay. Well, I don't need to make anything cold right now. But at least now we know that this exists, right? A big knife. You won't leave this place a lot. Oh, you won't leave this place. And it's another same exact map crossed off to the 15th only. Weird. There's a clock with no hands on the wall. Oddly enough, a bunch of apples that are still fresh. Figure that one out. Charred remains. Are these human bones? What the hell's going on here? Nice. It smells awful. It looks good. I'd dive right in. Especially if you're hungry, just fucking do it. The trash has been left to pile up. Oh no, I don't like this. What is with this lighting? Oh! There's something new in here. It's a new kind of enemy. I can't even see what it is. Oh. 
It was the wheelchair guy. Okay. He took one extra shot, it looks like. I'm almost out of ammo now. Ugly tuna roll took me $4.20. 728,177 floppy disks to one terabyte. Oh, how things have changed. Yeah. You couldn't really store too much on floppy disks back then. And they were all magnetic, so if you even got them near anything magnetic, that was the end of it. You would destroy your disk. Okay. He's dead. Now, what do we got over here? More nails? Good, because I just used a ton. Insert disk to write a new keyword. Well, if I find a blank disk, I should be able to write the password here. Then I could go open that other door with it, but I don't have a blank disk. Shit. Oh, that's too dark. There's another door. Oh, God. This place is such a fucking maze, man. What's that? Whoa. Whoa. Nitric acid. A ball of nitric acid that can corrode metal over time. Where have I seen metal that I would want to corrode? Hmm. Let me try to miss anything in the room. We know we gotta come here to code a disc once we get a blank. And I got something to corrode metal, but I don't know what metal we want to corrode right now. Hello, Archibald. I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. This is not an OG game, Archibald. This game came out last week. It plays like an OG game, but it's a brand new game. Tormented Souls. Door unlocked. Where did this go to? Door knocker shaped like a hand holding a ball. What the? Why? I don't know. I can try to go in this door. A closet. More nails. Excellent. At least I'm not trapped in the closet. But what is this? Oh, God. What is this? A battery can fit here. Dude, this game. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Yo, this game. I just punched this fucking thing. This game is ridiculous. You know how much stuff I'm going to have to fucking try to figure out? A battery fits here. Really? So, I, went, I was in the chapel. From the chapel, I came from the kitchen. And I went into this closet. Right? And that was the warehouse. It looks like now I could go up the stairs. And it looks like it says there that I need a key or something to get into the archives. This is so confusing, man. There's also a studio, recording studio. <sighs> what the fuck? That's all that's in here. Some nails and a battery, which I can't do. All right, ladies and gentlemen, shout out. To Sosituken Warrior, who just took me $27 and said the following. Back in the 80s growing up, it was more likely boys played games instead of girls. When I look at my nieces, six years old nowadays, it seems like more normalized that they join the video game action with the guys. Different times, I guess, you're cool. And I'm, I'm actually very happy about that. Because these things, like video games, what about video games exactly is so male-oriented? You could argue that back in the day when all the games were about Matt murdering monsters and stuff, but... There's so many different kinds of video games now with great stories. There's no reason that they should all be 100% dominated by males, okay? Back in the day when I used to play Street Fighter in arcades, it was 100% dudes. I'm glad to hear that now there's female females wanting to play games and things, you know, at competitive level in particular. That's good. So anyway, thank you to Sensei Warrior 
Very generous tip. You're the top tipper of the day, and now we're only $6 away from a vest. And by the way, we're going to be going on break shortly. Probably in another 10, 15 minutes, okay? <sighs> okay, if I go upstairs... Aha! Where am I? I'm confused. Where am I? Now I'm back in the kitchen. So I looped. Okay, I, I see. I went to the kitchen, the warehouse. There the closet went up, opened the door, and went back to the kitchen. I see. Okay. noise right so this is just this green room it has no name and that's the closet there's no other way to go here Okay. So that's where I came from, and I can't open it because there's a puzzle, right? Yeah. Wait, did I go in here? No. Oh, it sounds like a safe room. Studio. Stu stu studio. Oh. Oh, shotgun shells. Cool. I don't have the shotgun yet, but I'll certainly take that. We shouldn't have come here. Next right image showing a, a heart. The figure seems familiar. I'd like to save, but I don't have a tape. I hope I can find a tape soon. Oh, there's one. Uh, oh, stop changing my camera angle. There it is. I'm definitely saving. You know, after all that progress, I'm definitely saving. Okay. Let's save, and we'll probably take a break here. Probably makes sense to take a break here. The next room is going to be... Oh, it's going to go to a brand new hallway we haven't been to yet. There's a shower room, laundry room. So, all right. Let's save up. Okay. Slot. Slot C. Very good. All right. Good stuff. Time for us to take a break. Good chat.